सो वन सेकेंड गुड मॉर्निंग टू वन एंड ऑल सो लेट्स बिगिन विथ लेक्चर थ्री सो एज वी हैव डिस्कस सम लिटरेरी डिजाइंस इन द प्रीवियस लेक्चर नाउ वी विल फोकस ऑन वॉट वी हैव प्रपोज टू मिटिगेट द मिसलाइनमेंट प्रॉब्लम्स इन वायरलेस पावर ट्रांसफर सिस्टम्स सो एज आई ऑलरेडी सेट इन द ऑब्जेक्टिव दैट वी हैव अंडरवेंट एन इवोल्यूशनरी प्रोसेस टू अचीव द प्रपोज ऑब्जेक्टिव सो लेट्स डिस्कस अबाउट इट सो इफ यू सी this is the evolutionary process that we have actually uh, went through so if you see that uh, in this in the sub objective 1 we have targeted a uniform magnetic field using a 3d transmitter coil antennas so this is the first step we have underwent so then later what we have understood is the limitations of 3d transmitter coil uh, in implementation in the practical scenarios led us to investigate 2d planar coils to form a uniform magnetic field so that is comes under sub objective 2 or the evolutionary process 2 then later we understood that uh, whatever target that we are keeping that is to form a uniform magnetic field to mitigate the lateral misalignment problem may not be the optimal uh, method to actually uh, perform the optimization process rather because uniform magnetic field will ultimately ultimately give uniform induced voltage uh, in terms of uh, the outputs output output of the receiver coil antenna so instead of uh, actually forming uniform magnetic field let us keep an objective as uniform induced voltage and let us find what is the optimal magnetic field strength so that comes under of sub objective 3 and uh, interestingly we have found that uh, it is not the uniform magnetic field rather it is a non uniform magnetic field is the optimal magnetic field strength to mitigate the misalignment problem so however we'll discuss this uh, separately in evolutionary process 3 then later what we understood is in the design sub objective 1 to sub objective 3 that is the evolutionary process 1 to 3 uh, there are Uh, all the designs have a, a, a tremendous amount of flux leakage outside the receiver coil region uh, the reason is see under perfectly aligned condition let us suppose the receiver coil is perfectly aligned with the transmitter coil then we are actually spreading the uniformity because of the spreading there there is a huge amount of flux leakage is happening in the periphery of the receiver coil antenna where uh, uh, which is not entangled with the receiver coil so because of this enormous flux leakage the coupling between the transmitter and receiver coil is reduced and also the efficiency because the coupling is reduced uh, my efficiency will also decrease so to reduce that flux leakage we have went through switchable transmitter coil antennas so we have proposed a two designs uh, to to distinct designs based on switchable transmitter coils so then Uh, later on we have moved on to we have understood that because of the switchable transmitter coils and also the detection systems uh, the complexity and the cost of the system is enhancing so why not we can we can actually uh, why not we can move on the receiver side instead of targeting more on the transmitter side so therefore we also started the investigation of receiver coils to effectively capture the magnetic fields to mitigate the misalignment problems so in this way we have actually underwent from uh, 3d transmitter coil to the switchable transmitter coil at the uh, sub objective 4 and finally we we also started investigating at the receiver coil side so this evil this is what uh, this kind of evolutionary process we have underwent and we have found out the best possible designs that can mitigate lateral misalignment problem so with this uh, i want to end the lecture 3 and in the next from the next lecture onwards each evolutionary process we will discuss uh, in uh, elaborately thank you